Hello everyone, Mila here, and welcome back to the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. There's Sonic right there, obviously, he's got back to life. Uh, this game is a lot longer than I thought it would be. I thought it would be short enough that I could finish it in like two episodes, but this is part four. Eh. The yellow glow is chilling. I miss it, it was just showing us the weather. Yeah, no, you know, Eggman actually built the train. Well, that's better than the yellow glow, I guess. Hello? Hello? Anyone there? Why is no one responding to me? I miss Eagle Glow already. <laughs> you got some nerve showing up here, Egghead. Ho ho ho, you spiky blue pest. Seems you've finally taken passage on one of my passenger trains. You created this train? Who the heck are you? Don't talk to me! Ah, ignoring that. I still need to talk about you in my interview. My involvement isn't well known, civilian! The infrastructure in your town just wasn't cutting it. If I were to build Eggman land, these problems would need sorting out. So, I courageously got involved. I converted some cargo trains into passenger trains for the sake of the public. This is more useful for, f uh, for future schemes. Let me guess. Another death egg, Dr. Predictable? People fear giant spheres. It's science! Let's cut to the chase. Where are our friends? Show you my, my, judging by my security cameras, your pathetic friends are all locked in the cars they were stationed in. Seems you managed to make the train quite upset. Did you not know this was happening? Heavens no! I'm, no, I'm only now getting caught up. I'm far too busy to notice what a passenger train is up to. <laughs> uh... You see, the capability of a badnik is normally very basic. Just kill Sonic the Hedgehog. Now that's a motorbug, but I forget what that thing is called. But for a luxury train, I wanted to be sure things ran without my supervision. And report to me if any of you happened aboard. This train's capability of intellectual thought is extraordinary. A feat only accomplished by my genius. So this confirms it. The train really is sentient. Suffice to say, your capture is inevitable. You're on a train that desires nothing more than, delivers you, than, to, yeah, than to deliver you all to me. This happened so suddenly I can't talk properly. See, I got to thinking. I needed to manufacture motivation beyond programming. I like to make my bad necks compete against one another from time to time. It's good for productivity. Yeah, competition is t tends to be good for that. So I instituted a bounty upon my army, army of bad necks. First to capture you pathetic creatures gets a generous reward. The train wants to deliver us to Eggman. For a reward? What could it want, though? Most of my robots ask for something simple like my autograph or whatever, but a highly intelligent train. It may ask for something more interesting. As much as I like reward programs, are you done blabbering, Doc? You can never just win silently, can you? When you're dragged to my base, you'll regret the day you ever crossed me, Hedgehog. I already do. Get lost. <laughs> Ciao. He always knows how to get under my skin. This is tough. The train has a motivation, and being made by Eggman, it's no doubt powerful. Not to mention, we're all separated. Yeah, you were separated in Sonic Forces, not, not Sonic Forces, but Sonic Frontiers. I mean, you were technically separated from everything in Sonic Forces at first. What am I supposed to think? The train purposely had Sonic knocked out so it could deliver us to Eggman. This whole time we were all in danger, and I went along with it. I hope there's not too much egg, man. That hurt my voice. <laughs> that hurt my throat doing that. Sonic was really hurt. The conductor's been captured. Should I have been more assertive earlier? And I should have done more. Am I at fault here? I knew Sonic was hurt all along. Hey! I can tell the situation's getting to you. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I... I get it. The road's getting tough. It's easy to question the decisions that got you here. What negative thoughts at you? Let it pass and keep living. I need you here helping me think through this before I do something rash. <laughs> You're known for that, Sonic. See, I'm one of those leap before you think kind of guy. Yeah, you definitely are. <laughs> okay, you're right. Let's keep moving forward and make things right. Breathe. 
Okay. We gotta get to the conductor's car before the train arrives at Eggman's base. The door's a bit heavily fortified. How do we get through? What would you do? The entire day, Tails and I have been asking ourselves what would Sonic do? So, what would you do? What would I do? Well, I'd speed through head-on and rescue our friends by any means necessary. Here, stand back. Yeah. Wow, with one big wind-up, Sonic spin dashes fast enough to get the door open. Yeah, that's Sonic for you. Heh, <laughs> now the road's clear, nothing can stop us. Better hold on to your pants. I don't think we'll be getting another break after this. Ready to go? Let's go! That's a spirit. Let's go find our friends. So the conductor car to end this mystery. I don't need to look at uh, all the individual things going on. I wasn't. I wasn't even expecting the series to go on for this long. All right, our friends are locking the cars up ahead. For my last adventure, I'm accidentally my ring count gave me an extra boost of speed. <laughs> Sonic Frontiers. <laughs> if I can grab enough rings, I should be fast enough to bust through the next door too. Ready? Let's do this! Okay, so... Is that something that's actually happening? I mean, it shows Sonic dressed up, so like this is actually Sonic. Ah! I got it! Just wait till I see Eggman. I'm gonna clobber him! Gotta deal with the train first. Come on, let's go! Hmm. More eggs. Boing. Well, it came for us. Of course, but let's move. The train wants to take us prisoner and earn a reward. My reward is to get off this stupid train. Let's go. Oh, I took the path of less rings. Ah, one short. And then he just continues, I was falling. Like, oh, it was a short ring, so then I keep screwing it up over and over again. Next door. Sonic! It's about time. I thought you were supposed to be fast, Sonic. We gotta move. You two ready? Always. That's Boogie. 65 ring. <laughs> that is far right in. Mm -hmm. ah. I wanted to try to just jump over that, but that gap's too big. It's so, like most of this episode is just gonna be me uh, doing this mini game, huh? I keep failing it over and over again. But that's what I do. Like 
I got plenty of rings, actually. Yeah, way more than enough. They locked Amy and Tails in the conductor's car. Say no more. Let's go. enough rings too but I didn't jump right. That was the end of it probably. You hate it when you guide it and then you screw up. Well, it wouldn't be me if I did it right. <laughs> Sonic! Sonic, you're here! Heh, <laughs> this is no way to treat the birthday girl. You're right, I'm ready to stop this train. Time to finish this. It's weird that I'm doing it this game. Normally I try to avoid, uh, well, mostly avoid doing voices and such. Other than just lightly, but here I'm just going all in. My terrible voice acting. Excellent work trapping those pests. Now hurry to me! I must probably dispose of them to begin my plans for Eggman Land. And probably another death egg. <laughs> turn us into robots? Oh, ho, ho, I haven't done that in a while. Maybe I'll turn you on to robots to give Sage some new toys to play with. Ah, uh, yeah. You did mention uh, getting a power boost from getting enough rings. So, yeah, it would be after Sonic Frontiers. And he's talking about Sage, so there you go. Shut it, Eggman! Don't disappoint me, train! Hurry it up! I will not fail. My wish will be granted. Your wish? Oh, you mean the bounty. I don't care what you call it. Just bring me those overgrown mammals. Your hat, Eggman. I must get my wish. I will not fail. This is it, everyone. Get ready! We're taking this thing down! Oh, I kept my rings from before? Oh no, I just reset, okay. Oh! Yes. So we're on the outside of the train now? Like, where physically are we when we're doing this? None of you could possibly understand. We promised to be together our whole lives. How can you just leave like it was nothing? What do you mean? The conductor? He's retiring. You just have to accept that. My wish will keep us together forever. That's what being friends is all about. You can't force someone to be friends with you. That's messed up. Shut up. Just shut up. And that's all the train wants, is just stick with the conductor forever. Also try to do those bouncing spike balls. Boing! Eggman! Eggman! Can you hear me? My wish! My wish! My wish! Make the conductor never leave me! Let us be friends forever! Kind of friends who would never leave each other. Why would he betray me? Let's turn the conductor into a robot, huh? Oh, he's up there. I like this last one, it just kind of just keeps it going like this. Not real, not even more like the special stage of Sonic 2. Conductor! You promised me. You promised. Let him speak. Unhand him. Train, stop this. When I told you we'd be with each other forever, I was, young, I was a much younger man. I'm getting old. I'm tired. 
Excuses. How dare you abandon me? I'll be lonely. So lonely. Why must you insist loneliness upon me? No, stop. What are you doing to me? Please don't make me do this. Yeah, we have to rush you to the conductor if we ever want to stop this train. I know I'm fighting the train. I, mean, I think it was to begin with, but now I'm chasing it down. Yeah, I thought we were in the train, though. Like, where are we physically? A bunker train. There's the flicky inside. A flicky? This is just like the lore card. Right? When my ex best friend left detective work to join Dr. Eggman. So this really is a bad nick. Stakes rise every second, huh? You gotta save him. On it. Let's show our full power. And the Sonic's the only one that's actually doing anything. Ah! No, I fell in. I missed the spring. Sometimes you need the spring, sometimes you don't. I'll just fall in now, intentionally, because I messed that one up. Tell this is supposed to be like final boss type thing. That's obvious. But it would be better if I would, you know, stop screwing up. Ah. Uh, no! I was doing fine until I wasn't. Hey, I got a hundred rings. Just, just be delivered to Eggman already. What about, what about my happiness? Your happiness comes at the expense of others. Last I checked, that's called being selfish. Me? Selfish? How, how dare you? Bunk in the train, Sonic. Ow. Just walk right into the pits and well not the pit, but no, everything else. Certainly uh up the difficulty of these, as you'd expect. Tell me what gameplay is this. Boing. I'm gonna say I'm short on a ring, no. They're gonna make it eight hits. No, 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 no! Oh! I'll grab the flicky. It's over! Time to pay for ruining my birthday! <laughs> yeah, he's got a mean swing.
Get your Sonic. Trina's slowing down. Great hit, Amy. <laughs> it was pretty great, wasn't it? That's what you get when you mess up my special day. I... I just... Bzz, couldn't bear to see you go. I'm sorry bzz, for the trouble. Like our work here is done. Now let's get off this thing. Now remove the flicky. You just killed the train. Thank you. Goodbye, my friend. I may be leaving the rails, but I assure you, I'll never forget our time together. Happen? I did it to click? Okay, I was wondering. I didn't see a triangle at the bottom here. We did it! Well, I'll say I've never been on a train like that before. This universe has a unique way of doing things. Watch your step, watch your step. Yeah, it's over. The mystery of Sonic the Hedgehog's murder is officially over. Maybe next birthday we just ask Vanilla to make dinner. Oh? Don't you love parties while by the end someone tries to kill you? I think I'm actually going to miss the script's unhinged way of thinking. <laughs> Honey, you're late! I've been waiting here for hours! It's like, who's that? Oh, that's his wife. <laughs> you honestly never believe what happened! So I won't even try. <laughs> I'm just glad you're here! Quick! We leave, for, yeah, we leave for Spaghetti in the morning and you need to pack. I'll pack faster than the wind. I need this vacation something terrible. I need you home. Happy first day of retirement, dear. Seems the conductor is more than ready to begin his retirement after this ordeal. Yeah. I'm happy for them both. Oh, who's this? <laughs> An old friend, I think. Well, they're a cutie, that's for sure. Cheep, cheep, cheep! Yeah, I think that Flicky's gonna want to stick around with you. Seems that Flicky found a friend. Great job saving that little guy, SBL. It was the least I could do. Sonic, everyone, I sincerely apologize for the trouble I caused. Don't be. You were just following what you thought was the game. It's hard to know what I would have done in the same situation. I wouldn't have hit someone with a blow dart. Seriously, a dart? It would have been hard to get close to you otherwise, Mr. Speed of Sound. <laughs> Regardless, I am sorry. We're cool. Now that we're all safe, it was fun. This group has a wild idea of fun. Well, you don't know the crap they go through. Boy, am I starving. I forgot we never ate. With all the clatter, I completely forgot I was hungry. <laughs> me too. I was distracted playing detective. If only you could have seen me, Sonic. I was finding clues, presenting evidence, poking holes in alibis. Sonic? Wait, where'd he go? No, he's still in the picture. Everyone, guess what? The station is a bakery, and look what I bought! <laughs> ah, a birthday cake! Happy birthday, Amy! <laughs> the confident, unshakable, and radiant Amy Rose. So we've had a game about Sonic's birthday, Sonic Generations, now here's a game about Amy's birthday. It's about murdering Sonic, of all things. To an adventure of a birthday, darling. And there's a character right there, player. I'm wondering what the hell he's even supposed to be. A memorable, uh, a memorable party event, uh, party every year. Oh, I've right there. <laughs> to a fun birthday. A ride from start to finish. May our friendship grow stronger through each celebration. I admire your tenacity. May you never lose your vivacity. Happy birthday to Amy and her sparkling pernacity. 
Happy birthday! I was smart enough to know Fernesity is a word. <laughs> we love you, Amy! Happy birthday! Ah! Ah! You guys! You almost got murdered by a lonely train, but... But! I wouldn't trade these adventures for anything! Never in a million years! You guys would never leave me, right? Wouldn't dream of it. Now, let's have some cake! Yes, please! Dig it, everyone! <laughs> Drink Eggman is trying to do Vector now. <laughs> Yay! I hope it's chocolate. Uh, <laughs> Metal Sonic. Oh, Sage! <laughs> Let's go, Dad. <laughs> That trade that we're making it here, is it? Orbot, prepare a bath! The happy rubber duck or the angry one? Angry! <laughs> Sour choice, your evilness! I, I can't remember their voices. Shut it! <laughs> and that's my story of what I met Sonic and his friends. Tangled in their lives for a fleeting moment, then back to things as they were. City has realized Eggman is running the train system and fought back to seize control. Everything is squeaky clean now. As for me, I... <laughs> Stuck with it. And then... <laughs> back is my singing. And after all that, I... Ace of Flight Space! <laughs> yeah, so it's been my life. Okay, this was just a really, really silly game. And I really liked it, too. This game was really fun. Great job, so I got this. This was great. The uh, Sonic team didn't make it, they specifically said that. But, I, yeah, I didn't think Sonic would work so well as a game like this, but it did. It's like, wow. <laughs> I wouldn't mind more of these. And it was just a fun little uh, April Fool's gag game. But yeah, sure. Make more of these, Sega. Please do, I'll play these. I mean, I imagine other ones, that if they did more of these, they'd charge for them, of course. This is just a joke game, but I certainly wouldn't mind. <laughs> yeah, I'll pay for more of these things. Well, when I can afford it, anyway. Yeah, it was like Sonic Mix with Ace Attorney. I mean, can't go wrong with Ace Attorney. Those games are amazing. Bouncer Chow. <laughs> the director of lore. Yeah, Trade Manager of Lore. I heard that they started doing that after uh, Sonic Frontiers. Well, Yeah, for Sonic Frontiers and such, they actually created a lore thing just just for Sonic. We keep track of all of it so they can make a proper story going forward. Which is good, they should really do that. But I like all the references they did in Sonic Four it's like Frontiers and everything. And they reference Sonic Frontiers in this game. Sage even showed up! But we know Eggman did bring her back after at the end of Frontiers, based on the uh, true ending, if you did the hard mode. So if uh, Sonic is just going to be one consistent, straight-through story like this from now on? Heck yeah! Sales? What sales? He was free. <laughs> Normally, free games are not all that great, but in this case, 
It is. Good quality for a free game. It's like this uh, phone game I've begun playing a couple days ago. It's free, with lots of microtransaction, of course. But the, the game is really high quality, shockingly. And it's not by some uh, big company. It's just a little, you know, one of those little ones. That, that seems to, you know, the kind that so would typically make mobile games as just big cash grabs. The game is remarkably high quality. It's got, like, almost full voice acting, and the animation is great. The game looks really good. Wow. Big the cat the dog. <laughs> the stray cat's outside Justin's house. <laughs> I like all this silly stuff. Thank you, Sega, for letting us make this game. <laughs> Happy April Fool's Day. <laughs> Yeah, it was other people making this, uh, so, so this is like a fan game that Sega allowed them to make, huh? <laughs> Probably why it was free, because it was a fan game to begin with. But yeah, this is a really good game, and I wouldn't mind more of it. But this was just an extra series for April Fool's Day, so there's not going to be anything else on the weekends. I'm not going to play games, I'm not, I'm not playing games on the weekends and all that. So, uh, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time!